Well, I got um, got a message last night, which was uh, really nice to receive. And every now and again, once you you know you take the effort to compile a video and you put it up there for public viewing, uh, occasionally you know you do get some really positive feedback. And on this occasion, um, a viewer over in the uh, in the states. Um, he just commended me and uh, basically, you know, was just saying that, you know, the video that I put out looked nice, it's colourful, uh, it's a pleasure to watch, etc, etc. Um, and later on sent me um, a message uh, asking what kind of equipment I use. Well, quite simply, uh, the equipment that I use uh, for filming while out and about is... Um, it's just a Samsung S6 smartphone and on occasion I will use um, a Nikon AW110 uh, which is an all action camera um, but I only tend to use that if, if the phone dies and I haven't got a uh, battery pack with me but anyway this is not about the phones this is more about the equipment behind the phone uh, which kind of contributes to um, sort of making those videos so what I'm going to talk about today is uh, a specific little bit of equipment which um, has become a kind of must-have for being out and about and um, you know sort of taking what I consider to be not action pictures but you know pictures which involve um, as little handling as possible that allow me basically to hold the camera with one hand and sort of dig and pot around and find objects with the other. So um, anyway, uh, the piece of equipment behind all of this is um, a smartphone rig, uh, the Perfoto uh, smartphone rig. Um, a pretty versatile piece of equipment and we shall have a look at it. So uh, this is not quite an unboxing because I have been using it for a little bit, but I will um, take things out of the box so you can see exactly what you get. Okay, come with me. Okay, so here we go. Um, here we have the Perfoto smartphone rig. And uh, as I say, it's not quite an unboxing because I have been using this uh, particular piece of kit now for a little while. Uh, I will show you what comes in the box. But when you, uh, when you receive this, you know, this is basically uh, the rig itself. Uh, a very, very versatile piece of kit, which we will sure have a look at in a minute. It actually comes tucked away in this little carry bag, which is very nice. And inside the bag, there are also some other goodies, which I shall show you in a minute. And also some other goodies actually inside the box. But first, uh, let's just take a quick look at the rig itself. So, um, basically, this area here, if you can imagine um, holding the actual rig with this side facing you, this would be the area where the smartphone would go. And what I shall do is I'll swap cameras in a minute and actually put the, um, you know, my Samsung S6 in there so you can see how it looks. But um, with rigs of this nature, um, this axis here is fully adjustable and moves across according to the size of your phone and there is obviously this piece of kit here which secures your phone in place and as well this also would have helped if I bought a tripod today but never mind this is adjustable uh, according to the kind of phone you've got. So with a phone like mine, the S6, the actual lens of the camera is kind of down here so I can actually move that according to whatever phone I use. Um, on my previous phone, the lens would have been up here but regardless of what you're using, that is fully adjustable and obviously once in position, you know, that can be tightened up. Okay. So another few things um, about the rig. Uh, you might have seen as I just popped up the, uh, the guard there that there is a hot shoe, a 
attachment, which is quite handy if you want to, you know, sort of film using um, a light source, you know, a, a LED lamp, um, or you can actually put a boom mic on there, um, uh, and other things as well. Um, I have seen these being used with um, microphone mixers, you know, so the mixer would sit on here with stereo mics sort of here. Um, so yeah, that's a, a really, really handy addition. Also, you'll notice there are other uh, places on here for, um, I suppose, extendable arms or other big pieces of kit. So it is really well thought out. So there's one, two, and there's three on the bottom as well. And obviously the important one being, you know, for your tripod or uh, whatever kind of grip mount uh, that you want to use, stabilizer, etc., etc. So um, what we'll do now is I'm going to switch over um, cameras and um, I'm going to put my phone into the rig and you can have a, you, can, you can see what it actually looks like when it's in there. Okay, so bear with us, two ticks. Um, okay, so you can see that is now in and uh, that's pretty much what it kind of looks like and on the other side I'll show you there you go that I've adjusted according to where the lens is uh, on my phone so that gives me pretty decent stability on being able to use that with one hand where possible trying to minimize any sort of picture shake it's not too bad at stabilization I suppose given the number of attachments um, you know there's five uh, places on the rig where you can actually put attachments um, you could put you know a, a hand grip or um, a C-type grip, which uh, or C-type stabilizer actually, which is uh, the kind that I use, uh, which I don't have with me today. Otherwise, I would show you. Um, but yeah, there you go. That is pretty much a very very simple bit of kit. So what I'll do now is um, I'll just show you some of the accessories that this comes with, um, and I shall. In the process of talking, I shall, um, you know, put some of the accessories on so you can see the difference that those kind of things make. Okay. So, that's what uh, the phone looks like once it's actually placed in the rig and hopefully it gave you an idea of um, how simple um, it is to use. Let's have a look at some of the goodies that come with the grip itself should have brought a, a tripod I'm using one hand at the moment but um, comes with this nice little carry bag which is not a bad quality bag at all um, in that I'm not sure if you can see in there but there are two pockets which allow you to carry some of the uh, accessories that come with the rig so just take one or two things out are in there. It's probably easier if I tip it out in that way. I can show you a little easier. Let's put some of these things out over here. Okay, so So with this, come, this is a 37mm uh, wide angle lens, which converts down to a, a macro lens, um, quite simply by unscrewing. Also comes with um, a fisheye lens, I'm not a particular fan of fisheye lenses, but I suppose, um, you know, it 
they do have their uses in you know sort of vlogging and um, you know sort of video making this is a really really nice bit of kit this is uh, a 12 times zoom telephoto lens um, one of those on its own if you have a look on eBay they are pretty expensive pieces of kit um, but it all comes as part of the package which is fantastic so you are getting one lens which is the wide angle lens the macro lens which is ideal for close-ups the fisheye lens okay well fisheye is fisheye not much to say about that and of course the 12 times zoom telephoto lens um, I suppose okay the optics might not be the most expensive it's not quite um, you know Carl Zeiss lenses or anything like that but they are pretty decent quality and I shall tell you how much all this little bit of kit costs in one little minute um, you also get why I don't know but you get a star filter so I suppose when I do find a nice gold ring in the ground and I put the macro lens on I can actually put that star filter on it's a 10 times star and it'll make my gold ring sparkle how about that and I should use my wedding ring as an example a little bit later on um, for those who are maybe out and about at the seaside or hill walking or of that nature um, you also get um, a blue graduate um, filter as well as well all these are um, 37 millimeter um, and you do get this adapter plate which just screws onto the rig there like such and all your accessories as such whatever as long as it's all 37 millimeter um, it'll work okay you also get a funky little if you're into this kind of thing um, this little harness is um, forgotten the term for them now amazing what we've got on the spot isn't it? Um, if that's your kind of thing you know it's just a carry you know carry strap over the shoulder job it's not really my colour um, so for the sake of not using it and keeping it as new I will keep it in the package and use one that I've got um, you also get a nice little allen key plus some spare screws there's another one in there somewhere um, as you can see there's lots and lots of screws in various places so in case you lose one or two of those screws for whatever reason um, the manufacturers do give you spares um, you have these which are just fit on there like so um, they're basically for your shoulder strap okay so in a nutshell that is pretty much uh, the kit that I'm using behind um, using the phone you know to make uh, videos that I post on YouTube um, there are one or two other pieces of kit um, that I haven't got here at the moment uh, one being um, I will post pictures up so you can see what they look like um, one being um, a C-shape camera stabilizer which you can use for DSLR cameras um, smartphone rigs video cameras etc etc again lightweight very versatile um, and this little baby fits in there no problem at all and allows me to hold the camera pretty much like this and I can move it around tilt it whichever way I want to, to do that and it's a really nice stabilizing piece of equipment and you can get one of those little babies for about $12.95 on eBay. Um, so the magic question is, for the price that I paid for this, um, you will see on eBay that there are 
um, this kind of thing now is, is, is becoming a really competitive market. And if you do some research on various smart rigs that are available, um, you'll see that this particular one has, um, there's about three or four different companies using this exactly the same design. And they will have more than likely posted on the side there, their brand name. Um, and I'm not going to name drop, but um, a little bit of research into this kind of thing. And you will say, ooh, that looks exactly like the one that Moe's was showing. Um, but for a considerably, considerably higher cost. And incidentally, all those other smart rigs come with these accessories. All of those accessories, bag included, um, albeit these might be in different colours, um, but for more than double the price. So, billion dollar question, how much would a rig like this cost you? So, this one here, I paid £42 for and it was being advertised on eBay by um, distributing agent for Pofoto. Um, if anybody is interested, message me and I will send you the name of the person who distributes. Um, but it was on eBay um, for £50, which again is half the price of its uh, competitors out there at the moment. Uh, and incidentally, exactly the same rig, albeit with their brand name on it. Um, but this particular distributor on eBay was um, pretty much accepting um, best offers. So for the £50, I got it down to 42 50 which I think is an absolute steal, considering the technology and versatility you get uh, in the rig itself. The kind of lenses that you're getting you know these kind of things ain't cheap on their own you know um, dodgy looking strap some graduate filters and you know star effect filters and a little bag to go in and a nice box because a lot of boxes these days are pretty naff but um, there's not a lot on it it just shows you who makes it so that is the kit that I'm using. I shall now uh, spend some time just using the various adaptions on there. So I'll show you how this works, how the fisheye looks, um, you know, the macro and the wide angle lens. So there you go. Bear with us two minutes. Okay, so starting off with the fisheye lens. Um, This is kind of how it looks. I do have it. There you are, see? Typical fisheye. My hand is on the rig, as you can see. It is pretty wide angle. I really don't understand really why or what use people have for these, but that is. Nice doggy in the background. That's pretty much the fisheye. Okay. Okay, so the, uh, the phone is back to normal. On normal zoom. And what we'll do now is we'll put the wide angle lens on so you can have a look at how that looks. Two ticks. And here we go, this is with the wide angle lens on, no zoom on the phone, and that's not bad, that gives a much, much better field of view. So, with the wide angle lens off and the macro on, uh, the macro lens incidentally is more for uh, taking stills 
um, you know, photographs with. So uh, here's a couple of items that I found out while metal, metal detecting today. And uh, just to give um, an example, so with the macro lens on, that is a Jetton that I found earlier on. Hopefully that's giving, again, I'm looking through the viewfinder and through the sunglasses, but um, hopefully it is providing the detail that would otherwise not be found using the smartphone, considering how difficult it can be at autofocusing, etc, etc. Um, here is another that I found on the same site, and that's using the macro lens. And again, that comes with the photo package. So that is the macro. And to give an idea of up close and personal kind of photography, it's not doing a bad job at all. Okay, so there you go for a simple two times macro lens. Okay, so hopefully um, that's giving you an idea of uh, what a piece of kit like this could, um, you know, sort of add in terms of value and versatility, productivity, I suppose, once you get used to using smartphones for making videos. Um, but for the price, for around about 50 UK pounds, um, it's not a bad little package as well and as I said if you do sort of have a look around online you will see this very um, same rig albeit labelled with other uh, manufacturers um, trademarks uh, for considerably more but it's the same thing exactly the same and you get the same gizmos as well so it's something else to consider uh, for those out vlogging and it uh, doesn't matter what you're vlogging um, I'm out and about enjoying metal detecting and this comes with me sort of everywhere I go so um, thanks for joining me and hopefully uh, for the person who sent me the message asking um, you know about my videos um, hopefully that kind of answers your question my friend so take care and thanks for viewing. See you on the next one. Take care now.